Hello beautiful people, welcome back to New Face Entertainment. We well, thank you, we appreciate you for coming and also for those who are coming for the first time, please hit the red subscribe button and God will continue to bless you in all your endeavors. Thank you. All my wives were virgins when I married them, Ned Nico reveals. Full interview. Billionaire businessman Ned Nico has revealed that he is attracted to decent and moderate girls who do not expose themselves to the public. As the billionaire businessman knows how to invest well in business, he also knows how to see the right women with the right attitude to be involved with. He gave an account of his life, ranging from business, politics, travels, family, and more. He had a recent interview with Sunday Punch and he was quizzed that. You got married to a popular actress, Regina Daniels. Why her? Why not Regina? When I met her, I didn't even know who she was because I don't watch movies, whether British, Nigerian or American. Also, I am not a social media person. Up until that time, I didn't have Facebook or Instagram accounts. So, I didn't know about Regina until she came to my house with her family on a tour. My house in the village, Anyaka North local government area, Delta State, is a tourist attraction of sorts. I liked her when I saw her, especially when I found out that she was from that place. I had always wanted to have somebody, a wife, from my side. We were introduced to each other and one thing led to another. That was when I found out she is a very decent girl. I have always said that I wouldn't marry anybody who isn't a virgin and that is very important to me. When I found out that she was a virgin, it reinforced my decision to marry her. I married all my wives as virgins. The actress would agree to publicly speak about her marriage. During the interview, Mr. Nico talks about his love story with Regina. He said, Some people thought I met her, Regina, through her mother. We met, fell in love and got married within three weeks. When asked if she was not bothered about the public uproar that trailed her marriage, Regina said, The only thing I was worried about when he proposed was how I was going to tell my family and not what the public will say or think. I have learned a lot from him. I call him baby. I used to cook but my husband has stopped me from entering the kitchen because we have cooks and domestic staff. The couple also revealed that they both share common interests including a love for swimming. Mr. Nico said, I taught her how to swim and I learned under 20 minutes. I have taught over 700 people how to swim in the last four years. It is my passion that's why I'm building a sports university as you might know. He also gave a sneak peek into his private life. I don't drink alcohol, I don't eat meat or chicken. I am a Muslim, a lot of people don't know this. I converted when I was schooling in England. I am not religious but I believe in values and ethos that is what should guide everyone's conscience, he revealed. Some background. For many years, Regina was recognized as one of Nigeria's finest child stars who won many hearts after she starred in Marriage of Sorrow, at age 7. She shot into limelight when she featured in an Hollywood movie titled Miracle Child in 2010. Her mom, Rita Daniels, also an actress and chairperson of Actors Guild of Nigeria, Delta State Chapter, AGN, nurtured her to fame. Regina was famous in the Asaba Nollywood caucus but began to command attention especially on social media, after former Vice President Atiko Abubakar appointed her his youth campaign coordinator for Nollywood in January. Long before she was romantically linked with Mr. Nako, the actress had become an internet sensation due to her obsession with state-of-the-art cars and tattoos. She currently boasts almost 6 million Instagram followers. Mr. Nico has had a long-time affair with the Nigerian entertainment scene having bankrolled some movie projects in the past. The billionaire politician also financed his wife's latest movie project The Enemy I Know which featured musician, Naira Marley. The movie reportedly gulped N150M. He served in the House of Representatives from 1999 to 2003. In May 2019, the Independent National Electoral Commission withdrew the certificate of return given to Peter Nwa Oboshi, his opponent for the Delta North Senatorial District and presented it to him. Mr. Nako, however, 
lost out on July 16 after the Supreme Court dismissed the petition he filed against the primary election of Peter Nwa Oboshi. Subscribe to this channel. Tell your friends to subscribe to this channel. Subscribe to this channel is very very.